Okay, the first thing I got to do to uh, start mounting these tires is that I remember I took the valve stem out, so I got to put a new one in. I just uh, put a little lube on the new one. Stick it in the hole. Put my little valve stem tool on it. If it'll screw on there. You screw it on and then carefully pull it. Pull it on. And there's a new valve stem. Now the tire goes on. Okay, the, putting the tires back on the rims, they've had enough time to dry, so they should be, should be good to go here. I'm going to lube everything up really good. Again, no such thing as too much, too much lube on a tire. up here set the machine first one's easy second one's a little harder TV. You want to set the bead as fast as you can while the tire still has some lube on it. Otherwise if the lube dries and it's a little hard to get the bead set. That's what I found doing these tires anyway. I just fill them about 20 pounds on the tire change and then I'll finish airing them up once I bolt them up. And there it is, one black trailer wheel. Uh, three more to go.
That was almost a disaster. Forgot about my valve stem. Well, it's time to bolt these wheels back on now. And uh, I'm going to use the impact to, to run the, the lugs up. But once I get the trailer off the jack stands, I'm going to torque, torque the, the lug nuts. You always want to torque your lug nuts. You don't don't just run them up with the impact because uh, you're asking for a wheel to fall off if you do that.
Now, them are the kind of wheels Darth Dooley is supposed to be pulling. Trailer's back on the on its own wheels now. Uh, supposed to be supposed to be a nice day today. Sunny and warm. Uh, hopefully, I'll be able to open up the doors and uh, start cleaning up and painting these fenders. I got my fingers crossed for that. And uh, only thing left on the wheels there is they got to torque them. And uh, they're on, they're going to be on there for a good long time. Um, uh, taking the tires off also gave me uh, a chance to check them all out, make sure there was no nails that <coughs> that I uh, couldn't see from the outside, and uh, also allowed me to put new valve stems in. I know uh, one was rotted completely off almost I just barely pulled on it and it broke so that probably would have been a flat tire shortly so now uh, pretty sure that I won't have any flats or any problems with the tires besides running something over you never know when that's gonna happen so uh, hopefully uh, later on today I'll be able to maybe start painting those fenders hopefully <laughs> 